Rick Harrison has been left reeling by the death of his son. But how is he coping with this tragic event? And what does it mean for the future of Pawn Stars? After the devastating news broke about Adam Harrison's death on January 19, 2024, Pawn Stars creator Rick Harrison issued a heartfelt tribute to his son on Instagram. He posted a photo of them together and wrote, You will always be in my heart. I love you, Adam. Rick, along with his father, Richard Harrison, opened the Gold and Silver Pawn Shop in 1988, and by 2009, they'd launched their own hit reality TV series. On the show, Rick, his other son, Corey Harrison, and their family friend, Austin Lee Russell, help determine whether a customer's antique is valuable or not. Although Adam was known to have worked in the shop, he was never a part of the show and had not been seen for a while leading up to his death. On January 22, 2024, Rick revealed the cause of Adam's death in a statement to the New York Post, stating, Yes, I can confirm Adam died from a fentanyl overdose. Many fans and followers responded to his initial Instagram post, not only with heartfelt condolences, but also a collective commiseration about the ongoing drug crisis in the U.S. One commenter responded, I am so sorry for your loss, Rick. Too many of our children are taken by the disease of addiction. I've been doing this for almost 10 years now, and uh, at one time we would never find that. Now it's, we're catching it all the time. Rick Harrison further explained to the New York Post that awareness of the ongoing fentanyl issue must be spread throughout the nation. Rick went on to say that the prevalence of the deadly drug is becoming an increasingly pressing problem that cannot be ignored. He added, We must do better. On January 23, 2024, Rick posted a couple of pics of him at a younger age with a very young Adam. The first featured Adam sitting on his father's shoulders as they walked down a long flight of outdoor stairs, and the second was a cozy shot of the two of them snoozing on a couch. His caption was simply, Amazing memories. Thousands of fans sent their love to Rick. As one wrote, Heartbroken for you, good sir. Huge fan. Stay strong. Sadly, many of Rick's followers knew or were related to a young person who'd also died from addiction. And Pawn Star's status as a worldwide mega hit was demonstrated by the fact that so many responses were from countries such as Portugal, Mexico, Spain, and more. As one viewer from overseas wrote, Sorry about all this, Rick. You didn't deserve it. You and your TV program will always be legendary. Social media was abuzz with an outpouring of prayers and condolences in the wake of the tragic death. And as word has spread, fans have begun to wonder if Adam's tragic passing would have any impact on the series going forward. Laura Herlovich, a representative for Rick Harrison, clarified to the New York Post on January 23rd, Filming begins in February, on new episodes, and Adam's death will in no way impact Rick's involvement with the show. She reiterated that Adam had not been involved in the production of Pawn Stars, and further remarked that she didn't foresee it having any effect on the upcoming season. The show also has a spin-off called Pawn Stars Do America, in which Rick, Corey Harrison, and Chum Lee Russell travel across America uncovering even more spectacular treasures. A History Channel spokesperson explained to the Post exactly why Adam's death would not affect this show either, noting, We have new episodes of Pawn Stars Do America beginning to air on Wednesday, February 21st. We wrapped filming on the episodes last year, so no changes. If you or anyone you know needs help with addiction issues, help is available. Visit the Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Administration website or contact SAMHSA's National Helpline at 1-800-662-HELP-4357.